Hello viewers, welcome to my channel. This is Geetha. Study the given information carefully and answer the questions that follow. The given below graph shows the percentage distribution of the number of cakes baked by 5 shops on a given day. Total number of cakes baked by the 5 shops were 400. So this is the percentage distribution like out of 400 cakes A this is the dark blue color which is 10% so A made 10% of cakes B 20% of cakes C 35% of cakes D 20% of cakes and E 15% of cakes. The given below table shows the percentage of cakes order from the 5 shops out of the baked cakes. So this is the shop and the percentage of cakes ordered from these shops for example A shop A made 10% of cakes out of this 400 and out of this 60% were ordered. Note, number of cakes unsold will be equals to, we know that the number of cakes baked minus the number of cakes ordered. So for example, check for A alone. So which is for shop A out of 400 cakes, it made 10% that is cakes made. So which is, this is only for A I am doing here. So out of this 400, it made 10% of cakes, 10 by 100. So, 0, 0 get cancelled and 0, 0 get cancelled, which is equals 40 times 1 is 40. So, out of this 400 cakes, it made only 40 cakes and out of this 40 cakes, 60% were ordered, which is sold. So, the sold cakes here is 40. Out of this 40 cakes, 60%, which is 60 by 100. Again, 0, 0 gets cancelled. And 0, 0 gets cancelled, which is 6 times 4 is 24. Which is out of the 40 cakes they made, sold they sold 24 cakes. Which means the unsold cakes are this 40 minus 24, which is 16. So, 16 cakes were unsold. So, this is the data we are going to find for the rest of the shops. Let's find this data for the rest of the shops here before solving this problem. So, now for B, first let's find the number of cakes they made, which is 400 times for B. It is 20%, which is 20 by 100. 0, 0 gets cancelled, 0, 0 gets cancelled, which is 40 times 2 is 80. Number of cakes made by shop B is 80. Sold. So, percentage of cakes ordered from shop B is 75%. So, out of this 80 cakes, 75% were sold, which is 0, 0 gets cancelled. You can simplify this by any way, you, any method, whichever is easy for you. So, 2, 4 times is 8, 2, 5 times is 10 and 5, 15 times is 75. So, which is equals 15 times 4 is 60. So, the cake sold here is 60, which means the unsold cakes, which is 80 minus 60, which is equals 20. Now, for the shop C, out of this 400, let's see the number of cakes they made, which is C. 35% out of this 400 cakes they made 35% 35 by 100 0 0 gets cancelled so 4 times 35 is 140 cakes and the cakes ordered from this shop is 80% which is out of this 140 80% of cakes were sold from here which is 0 0 gets cancelled again 0 0 gets cancelled 14 times 8 which is 112 so the number of unsold cakes here is 140 minus 112 which is 28 and now for the shop D, which is 20%, they made the 20% of cakes out of this 400. So, which is, you can also find like this, which is 20% of cakes here is, 10% is 40, so which is 20% is 80. Or you can also divide by 5, which is 80. So, there are multiple methods to find the percentage value. 0, 0 gets cancelled, 0, 0 gets cancelled and 2 times 40 is 80. And the number of cakes sold here, 95%, out of this 80, cakes 95 percent of the cakes are sold which is again 0 0 gets cancelled to 4 times as 8 to 5 times as 10 5 1 times as 5 and difference is 4 and 5 9 times as 45 so 19 times 4 is 19 times 4 is 76 so the difference is unsold cakes is just 4 and for the shop e which is they made 15 percent of cakes so which is out of this 400 they made 15% which is 15 by 100 again 0 0 get cancelled and 15 times 4 is 60 so again out of the 60 cakes the number of cakes sold here is 90% which is 90 by 100 again same method you can follow which is like out of this 100% is 60 so there is 10% minus which is 10% is 6 so 60 minus 6 is 54 
or you can do this method which is 0 0 gets cancelled 0 0 gets cancelled 6 times 9 is 54 anything is fine so 60 minus 54 equals 6 which means 6 cakes is left unsold here so now we have the data for shop a shop b shop c shop d and shop e now 54th question is we are solving from sbi po 2020 question paper the number of cakes unsold from shop e is what percentage more than the number of cakes unsold from shop d so here shop e is more compared to shop d because they are asking for shop e is what percentage more than the number of cakes sold from shop d shop e minus shop d divided by shop d times 100 percent so the values are e is unsold cakes are 6 minus unsold cakes in shop d is 4 divided by shop d times 100 percent which is equals 2 by 4 times 100 percent which is 2 1 times 2 2 times 4 you can so I'll simplify this any method so 250 method times 250 times is 100 so equals 50 percent so which means the percentage more than this shop e is what percentage more than the number of cakes unsold from shop d is 50 percent thanks for watching if you have any doubts please let me know in the comments